feet! He got his feet! Look at As are we. Lucky to be in your furious company. Should I apologize for putting you back to work? Not at all. Not at all. My blood runs quick now. With the roar of battle. By Zeus, I have not seen this much action since the earliest days of Cleopatra's father. Let's not celebrate too roundly, old man. We're afloat in the sea with a cargo with a thousand ships. And I wonder if Cleopatra survived unmarked. Those clothes looked expensive. All are safe, we're done. <laughs> Attacking Star Wars! Oh, we are not done! Ptolemy's Malachi are not dead yet! Get out of the reed boats! Use the fog to hide your escape! But I will take care of this. Destiny is a fucker sometimes, Aya. Enjoy the calm water. I will stay in the storm. <laughs> Free, you fool! Don't mind the flaming arrows, huh? <laughs> For battle, we will honor our goddess! We cannot afford to spill any Roman blood. Cannot traipse into the palace armed to the teeth. So we disarm then. Armed or not, they will recognize her. For once, perhaps a queen's entrance is unnecessary. Act natural. We are meant to preside these grounds. Remember that. Is our queen all right? I'm fine. Who are we? Let me do the talking. None pass here without escort or a royal seal. I am the nomarch of Heliopolis. These are my philakitai. We bring gifts from our local merchants. Let them pass with an escort. Follow me. This way. Our Imperator appreciates the hospitality. Have you received the warm welcome our pharaohs always provide? We will not celebrate until an alliance is sealed. Your vizier and your king have given us fine accommodations here in the palace. However, I cannot guarantee my Imperator will hold court with you. We understand. You are a good legionary. We will be patient. Do you think we could take them all? Of course. We have better gods than them. Are we there yet? Yes, Legionary. At ease. We are with the great Pharaoh Ptolemy XIII, his envoys from the east, with gifts for your Imperator. Carry on, then. An offering? Would you like me to help you carry your carpet? No, sorry. It is very sacred. Must be handled by the Philakitai. They understand the merchandise. Dukes. 
Step aside, legionnaires. Official business for the Pharaoh. Who are you? You look like a hippodrome racer. Huh. I am. You should see me race. The C1 warrior. Continue this way. Guest legionary, at ease. You will stay in the palace. All politics are concluded. The palace is at your disposition, Caius. Pompey was bound to be killed sooner or later. Pompey was your enemy, Caesar. He was my friend first. You are right, Ptolemy. Now let us discuss our alliance. <sighs> what is this? Forgive, Lord Caesar. We bring a gift from our pharaoh, Cleopatra. Pharaoh? This is no gift. These are my sister's friends. It is a trap. In place of an envoy, Cleopatra sends a rug? I wonder how you all entered my palace. God! Kill these traitors! My wretched brother. He's at the wine go to vinegar. And my kingdom to pieces. Great lady. Your audacity is equaled only by your beauty. Flavius, please. I can offer you what my brother failed at with me. Marriage. A true marriage, that is. If you ally with my sister, I will kill every last Roman in Alexandria. Enough of the big words, little brother. Out, all. You will each be sent for when our Congress is concluded. I wish to hear both Ptolemy's side of the story. Portinus and Septimius gone. We miss them. You will have your vengeance soon. This is Cleopatra's time to officially become queen. If she is crowned queen, we will be able to act from within. Crush the network. Tomorrow, our queen will have turned flattery into progress. We'll reconvene tomorrow at the gardens. You proved your worth tenfold today. You truly are great Medjais. Aya, dear one, thank you for coming. All is well with great Caesar. Good, my queen. Soon you will be on your throne. Yes, yes. I must ask you a favor, though. The tomb. I fear Lord Caesar should have the honor to bear witness to the author of our kingdom, Alexander the Great. You want to impress your new lover, I see. The tomb is sealed, no? <laughs> It is, but by an act of Gaia, not a royal decree. An earthquake in the early days of my father's reign has blocked the door. Do you know our metropolis well enough to suggest an alternate means of entry? The underground. You would enter from below? Well, I would find a way into the cisterns and canals below, work backwards and find a way to clear a passage into the tomb. That would solve our problem, but it seems idealistic. Fortune favors those who ignore her. I'll examine the area around the tomb and figure this out. Excellent. Rejoice.
Did I tell you of the poet Catullus? I don't believe so. Another cur who made brief mention of me in his verse. It is a dead end, my lady. I will double check. Ensure it is. Really? You insult our efforts. We tried everything. <laughs> Broken spears. These Romans really did try everything. They got it right. This way is completely blocked. That earthquake must have altered the structure. Hmm. Strange. This wall is not as solid as it looks. There must be a way beneath. Around! This is a tighter squeeze than the cave west of Siwa. We were smaller in those days. Now, my love. It must be through the sewers. No one had the courage to plunge into Hades' rivers. We are the ones. After you, Aya. One big crocodile. May its soul rest in peace. About time you showed up. I was guarding your rear. My rear is fine. that his sarcophagus is full of honey. Helps preserve the car. <laughs> oh, unbelievable. Promise me you will bury me with my blade, so I can protect myself in the field of reeds. Promise. These markings along the bottom, they speak of Siwa, the vault, and a scepter that Alexander holds. A moon stands in a field of trees, where a marked sphere meets its scepter. Man to king, king to god. A marked sphere? What did you do with the orb I gave you? I gave it to Apollodorus. He loves those things. We should let the others in. I'm going to keep looking around. His paintings on the wall.
birth. He was Macedonian, a Greek that became Egyptian, like me. <laughs> he began the rule of our latest pharaohs. He founded Alexandria and brought us the great library where Aristotle mentored him. He abandoned education for bloodshed. Hmm. Not unlike us. He was hailed as a savior when he first arrived in Memphis. He was a conqueror. Here is when he crowned Ptolemy Lagos as his successor. So the rule... stuff he is holding. The markings. Ever since I was a boy, I've idolized this man. He is similar to you. I wept at the base of his statue in Rome. At 30, he was a god with an empire stretching across the known world. What have I done with my five long decades here on Earth? It me to you vent! Together we can do more than Alexander did. Yes. How long before the Queen stops impressing Caesar? starts impressing us. Our needs are hers as well. She will deliver. My Caesar, our emissaries have been captured at the southern garrison of Alexandria. Soldiers have reported a hostile environment. Captured? Is this Ptolemy's diplomacy? I will send my guard. Greek soldiers will pass more freely through the city than Romans. Let us settle this matter, my queen. Flavius, come. Look. We have found the great king. Taking on the entire garrison will not be easy. I may not have to take on the entire garrison. A calculated kill and a shadowy presence will fare better. If you take on the armies of Ptolemy, I would like to be at your side. I will distract the garrison with a brawl. A fine idea. I will procure the emissaries. Thank you. 
This area is well watched. Come to save you. We need to alert Caesar. What happened to you? Septimius. They are preparing a siege of the harbor. They want to take the palace. I will not betray Caesar! How many more heads must I chop off before Caesar understands? This is futile. A change of plans. The lion says we must march on the Pharos and trap the queen. Then they said, 
They left for... Where? Where? This guy may have more valuable information. I need to bring him back to Caesar. Find your horse. 